You place your phone on a pad. No clicks, no cables. But it charges. How? Well, that's what we're going to be looking at today. In this video, I'm going to be explaining exactly how wireless charging works. First, let's start with the system that makes it function. Wireless charging seems like magic, but it's actually not. It's science. Pretty old science, actually. But it's being used in a brand new way. It's possible thanks to something called electromagnetic induction. Yeah, that's how you say that. Electromagnetic induction was discovered all the way back in the 1830s, making it almost 200 years old. But what is it? Well, when electricity flows through a wire, it creates an invisible magnetic field around the wire. And when you place another coil of wire nearby, that magnetic field can push electrons inside it, creating electricity between the two without physical contact. And this is exactly what your charging pad does. It uses electricity that constantly reverses direction, which can also be known as an alternating current, and this creates a pulsing electromagnetic field between your phone and the charging pad. Because your phone also has a coil inside it, when it gets close, the magnetic field passes through the phone's coil and pushes electrons through it, and that movement of electrons becomes electric current, which powers your battery and then charges your phone. However, for this to work, the two coils, the one in the pad and the one in the phone, have to be lined up. Not perfectly, but they have to be in a certain distance of each other. And even when this does work, wireless charging is usually less efficient than using a cable. Some energy is lost as heat, and that's why your phone sometimes gets warm. But wait, I hear you say. I've seen people put phones anywhere on a charging pad, and it still charges. Why is that? Well, this is mostly just because of how fast technology is evolving. Newer phones use smarter chips to fine-tune alignment, and some even use magnetic rings to snap the coils into place, like Apple's new MagSafe technology. This technology is also being used beyond phones. It's being explored for cars, kitchen appliances, and even for entire rooms. Imagine a world where you could drive your car into your garage, and it just started charging. That would be weird, but pretty cool. So the next time you sit your phone down and it starts to charge, remember, using 19th century physics to power a 21st century device. And I don't know about you, but I think that that's pretty cool. Hey, you made it all the way to the end. Thank you so much for watching this video. It's a bit late for introductions, but I'm Future Frame. I make short analysis videos about tech you use every day or hidden technology you didn't even know existed. So subscribe if you want to see more of that. Anyways, that's all for me. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.